back here. I know we haven't done a video for a while. Um, it's getting fall season. You can see all the leaves changing. So we're going to be wrapping up our season here. Um, I'm, it's supposed to, uh, next couple days, it's supposed to be in the 70s. And then after that, it's going to drop. Um, so basically, we're kind of just finishing up our season and getting our last mows in. Maybe we'll be still mowing. He's uh, getting this yard done. He's kind of chewing up the leaves. Um, that's one of the things that they did. Make sure that we mulched up chewing leaves for him. So that's what he's in the process of doing. Back here. Their trees look like they dropped most of their leaves. So that's what he's in the process of doing. I already wasn't really a lot of trimming to do. Nothing has really been growing, growing. Um, next couple of days we're going to try to, well today and tomorrow, tomorrow mostly, going to run out of daylight. The sun's been setting earlier. Obviously it's coming up well it's fall right now but um so we've been running out of daylight pretty quickly we used to be able to mow up to like eight but now we can only mow up to about six so we're going to finish up this yard maybe try to do one more before the sun sets we'll see what our time looks like and then try to bust out the rest of our yards tomorrow uh monday tomorrow sunday tomorrow and uh monday and tuesday the temperature is supposed to drop and it's supposed to rain so he's he's already done the one side. He's got to finish back here. Hey, got a lot of walnuts in this yard. <laughs> um, but he's already done this side. Anyway, there's like a fluffy toy. Oh, dog toy got chewed up here. Anyway, he's already done this side. Like I said, I I trimmed, and as soon as he's done, I'll blow off, and then we'll try to maybe try to squeeze one more out. See what happens. That's look at those trees. Isn't that gorgeous? I do like fall. It is one of my favorite seasons. I'm gonna try to get some of them stripes. Yeah. Now he's gonna finish this off, and then. Uh, Kind of a somber time of the year you know you're getting your seasons are winding down days are getting colder there's a lot of helicopters oops <laughs> my garbage <sighs> but yeah anyway we've uh, still got the trailer double side he's been using the back to get it off because uh, that mower weighs a lot more and when he was using the side ramp the weight of it was breaking the metal off of it we added this box to keep our straps and stuff in so I'll have the two echoes we gotta take echo backpack blowers we're going to take, we're, right now we're just using these ramps to get the mower off of it, but we're going to, we're going to extend this deck. They never, they don't make the, uh, the freaking gates long enough, so it's all, usually, so it's so hard to get the mowers off of, but anyway, we're still running the echo trimmers. 
this is mine. I've been using his. Mine, um, it hasn't been running right. It's hard to keep it running. It really needs a good tune-up. So we're going to uh, take it to our local dealership, uh, Prairie Ag, and see if they could take it apart. Um, there's certain special tools you have to use to tune it all up. and So we're going to take it to them and have them go through it and try to figure out what's wrong with it. Um, so I've been using his. His runs fine. But we yep, still have our blue truck. We got we sold our gray truck. We had a gray truck. And we sold that. And all that and I ended up purchasing for myself. He got himself a 1987 uh, Chevy C20 pickup that he's gonna be restoring. And I was a little jealous. So I found myself a 1976 Ford LTD station wagon. This, this station wagon came from Nevada. It was shipped here from Nevada to Iowa. And it is the most beautiful vehicle I've ever seen. There's no rust. There's The underbody is magnificent. It's never seen snow. The guy's always had it um, in his shop. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to put, put it in the shop for the winter and uh, slowly work on it. It's got some things that needs to be done, needs some paint. Um, some of the trimming's missing. We're gonna find some trimming. And just kinda do, you know, go through it and uh, make it ours, very much. Um, so we could take it to some car shows. With um, He's taking it to some car shows, but, and uh, people really liked it, so that's what our goal is. And then, of course, fix up, fix, fix up the 87. We're going to fix up the 87 pickup, too, and make it show quality. And uh, so that's size snow removal, which I, that's a hit or miss for winters around here. Last couple winters, we've had maybe two significant snow, uh, snow storms where we actually uh, went out and did it, but other than that, the last couple winters have just been so mild. I mean, I don't know. So, looks like he's done, so I'm gonna go grab the blower and blow off, and I wanna thank you for watching, and uh, have a good afternoon.